go to following directory as shown in the video right html then run following git clone command with this url as shown in the video sudo git clone and pass this dbwa github url dg ninja just rename dbwa to small dbwa with mb command give permission to that folder or directory get inside that directory as shown in the video go to config directory copy this .dist file to config.inc.php use command mouse pad to edit the file config.inc.php now set the db user and db password later in this video i'll change this again to user1 and password don't be confused use what you like user pass i'll change that later don't be confused let's check db password pass db user user sudo apt dash get install default my sql server right nothing nothing upgraded nothing installed because it is already available not a problem start my sql sudo service my sql start check the status we are trying to install and run dbwa in our Kali Linux machine, this is the process, right? We are going through the process. MySQL is started and running. sudo MySQL dash u root dash p mariadb get into this screen with this command, right? Now pass this command as shown in the screen. User 1 at 127.0.0.1 localhost assign the password and follow the screen Later on, I will send that user and password that assigned in config file to user1 and password, so don't be confused. Now move to same directory here as shown in the figure, in the video, etc, psp, 8.2, apache2, sudo mousepad, psp.ini, we have to turn on something here look at the video you can also search from the bottom get 
Click that search. Allow underscore URL underscore. They have open. Search it. You will get it. Turn it on. If it is off, right? In my case, it is on. And also search another one. URL underscore include and turn it on, right? We are trying to install and run DBWA in our local machine, Kali Linux. This is the process going on. Pseudo service Apache 2 start. Follow the video. If any confusion arises, then ask in. Comment. Let's check the status. Apache 2. It is active and running. I'm going to this section right now, right? You can skip this one because I'm going here to change the user uh, DB user name and DB user password, right? That I said earlier, user one and password, right? I'll change that. You do not need to change that, right? So you can skip this one, shorten this part. I said earlier, I'll change this here. You do not need to change your previously set user and password, right? Now let's go to browser. 127.0.0.1 dbwa setup.php now it's running right click create reset database now you'll get the login screen pass username admin and password password and click login okay we are logged in thank you very much for watching